Hey! So we are in Georgetown, South Carolina, and we are investigating a really old business building. Uh, it's three stories. Uh, we are in the basement right now. And um, basically there's a lot of activity going on and a lot of bad feelings in certain areas. And uh, we have video footage of a uh, light going on from a security camera. And this was at 4 a.m. and nobody was in this building uh, this is a insurance office it's a professional building uh, the building it's in is from roughly 1785 I uh, don't know exactly what's been going on here uh, I did hear I have not researched it but I did hear that this was a customs building for Georgetown South Carolina for a period of time actually that was its original purpose from what I understand <clears throat> um, certain areas of concern I'll show you this door right here to a furnace that runs up all three floors bad feelings are felt this is the main office right here Give you a quick sneak peek of it there Quick run through of it. This is a room of concern. These are the meters that have been going off. Hey, sir, what about Hello, this is Miss Tina. She is with us tonight. The digital and, and Ray is with us, and we also have a skeptic with us right here. Uh, he's starting to become less skeptical as the night goes on. And uh, this is the area where the light came on. Uh, the security camera is stationed right over there behind the TV and was shooting this way. Now you see this light in here come on. This is the dimmer switch that was used. This is the door that was closed. Okay, and so the secondary light source actually came from this pipe that is unobstructed to this room. And so this room right here So this room right here, I got to tell you, as soon as you walk in, you feel heavy. It feels harder to breathe. Uh, it's not a good room at all. And other areas of this, this office building um, feels almost inviting. You know, it's, it's really weird. I've, I've had the same uh, feelings that have been described to me by people since I've been here. People, since I've been here, we've been here about an hour whole lot of EMF spikes going on for no reason. Uh, these, of course, you can hear it. These are transient electromagnetic fields. So they're roaming, whatever they are. Digital recorder session mm -hmm. and the common room. Team moving. Is there anyone that would like to speak with us tonight? We have five random devices just laying around. You can go up to either one of them and make them go off to let us know you're here. I'm 
starting to feel weight on my head, like weight around my forehead. Are you standing here with us? Could you make one of these devices beep and go off? Could you tell me your name? Could you tell me your name? Can you tell me why you're here? Ending session. They shut itself off. Yeah. All of them's doing it. They're not supposed to come up. Is your room? If you come close to this, you can make this device go off. Could you come stand over here by me? Would you like to come up and walk by me? Let me know you're here. Make something go off. I have all these electronic devices around me. Make one of them go off for me. When you're strong enough to turn a light on, I'm sure you're strong enough to walk by one of these little electronic things. These little machines and make it go off. We're here to we're here to talk to you and see what you are. If you talk to me, I can hear you with this little machine in my hand. And it'll let me hear your voice. Could you tell me why you turned on the light? You wanted to be seen.
go dark, but I have this little fella right here. And this is from the Attic Junkie. It's a little REM pod, and they, uh, they're a little mom and pop's place. And that's their name right there. And uh, they're really cool. Got a hold of them on eBay. Uh, they shipped it out to me. It seems to work just fine. So we're going to check it out tonight. This is its first official go. Alright, we are lights out. And we're going to um, do another quick digital recorder birth session in the dark um, over here. I have a REM pod on the couch next to this door. That seems to be an issue. Ray Tina. Ray Tina. Or the cameraman. This is a recorder session in the front area. Now that we're in the dark, do you feel more comfortable? You don't have to run upstairs to get away from us. You don't have to run upstairs to get away from us. All we want to do is talk to you. There's no need for you to be afraid of us. Is there anything you want to tell anybody? If you tell me your name into this red light, I'll be able to hear you later. You can tell me anything you want. What we want to know is are you friendly or do you mean any ill will to anybody? Are you evil or are you good? Yeah. My battery's about eight. 
I got an ace about it or Yes, ma'am. Mm -hmm. did, did you do that? Don't mm -hmm. tell me that. Did you do that? No, I swear to God, I have not touched you. No, I'm scared. You're scared? Yeah. No, I'm scared. go up to the top of the stairs, the middle of the stairs, and uh, shut the door on me, and I'm going to do a it's getting hard to breathe. Uh, EVP session. Like yeah, yeah, yeah. The, the door is open, and that's what it feels like. So I'm just going to be there. Okay, so I'm getting ready to go up these stairs. Ray's going to shut the door behind me, and I'm going to do, do a quick burst session. Go ahead and shut the door on me, right? Uh, there is a light on to the second floor. I can see it underneath the door. This is about spooky as hell. Um, yeah. Justin. <clears throat> Could you tell me my name? They all know me. I'm sure you know my name. They all know me. I'm sure you know my name. Can you say my name? Can you say the name of anybody that's downstairs right now? I just, I can see underneath this door. I just, I just know some, some feet are gonna walk by it. I swear that's what it feels like. I can see a little bit of light. There's a, there's a light on. Feels like I, uh, I can't tell if I'm seeing something from under the door or not. I'm halfway up these stairs right now, so falling down is not a good idea. Can you make a sound? Bang something for me. Sound bang something for me. Let me know you're here. Why did you turn that light on? People seeing you turn that light on and then turn it back off. So you can be quiet, turn it back off. So you can be quiet all you want to. I know you're here. Now I want to talk to you. Session. Back down these steep ass stairs. 
Holy shit, it full. Somebody behind me? You walking down the stairs with me? I feel like I need to walk down these stairs backwards now because it just felt like something was all over me. Come on. I mean, you can startle me, but she ain't gonna scare me. Was that you right behind me? I'm feeling pretty cold right now. Digital recorder session, main office. The lady that works here in this office says she feels uncomfortable. Did you hear something walking in the back? Mm -hmm. Is that you making her feel uncomfortable? Did you work here? Did you use that bathroom? Could you tell us your name and why you're here? Could you tell us why you're bothering people that work here? Yeah, I heard it. Is that you banging in the bathroom? Bang again for me. Mm -hmm. I have this thing called a spirit box, and you know how electricity works. Yours, plate. You've been manipulating electricity, so you can manipulate this and talk to me. Going from quarter to half of my battery like keep pops in. Are we welcome here? What's your name? How many people's in this room right now? Four. They just said four. Can you tell us why you're here? There's four of us. Including us, how many people's in this room right here? Are you the one that touched Tony earlier? Why did you touch Tony? The f they cut off. Yeah, I think I did it. What the fuck? What the fuck was that? What the? What the? Did you hear that? 
that I think that happened when the AC cut off. Cause it happened. I don't know. That, that was a like that was a good knock. That no, that sounded like a growl. Uh, to me, it sounded like a knock. And my lights flashing hardcore. My my night vision on that one flashing hardcore. All right, you're draining all of our batteries and messing with our equipment. Do you just not want to talk to us? Are you in the bathroom right now? That bathroom area? Are you making it cold around me? Are you here? Come up to this black box. Touch that antenna. I am so cold right now. I'm getting that same way and I got a jacket on. I am freezing. I'm being free. You don't feel my you don't feel my fingers? Are you making it cold in here? You got plenty of energy from all the batteries you've taken. You hear that? Mm -hmm. I heard a voice with my ear. Sound like a man's voice. Are you a man? Um. Are you a woman? Can you tell us how old you are? I hear a woman's voice. 26. Can you tell us your name? Thank you for talking to us. We really appreciate it. Do you know what year you died? Did it say 30? It's not like either 20 or 30. We are not here to cause ill will. That is a job. What? Are we welcome here? I'm like saying yes. I just thought something touched my arm. Are you trying to touch us? Yeah. Yep. <clears throat> Are you trying to scare the people that work here? Do you know the name of the lady that works in this office? Did you tell me your name? Can you touch that metal rod sticking out that black box over there? Come up and touch it. All you got to do is get close to the table. You touched me. You can touch it. Let us know you're here. We heard you banging in the back. We've heard something walking upstairs. Is it? seen you turn on the light. Is there a child in this room? Oh, 
can't tell you. Can you tell us your name? It feels like I can almost see my breath. Mm -hmm. I felt like something just blowed on my head. Do you not like that thing? Do you not like us recording you? It's getting hard to talk. Yeah, I'm not done. I'm feeling sick. Are you affecting us right now?